Jersey Times and the world of University of Maryland hoops. You have the men's side, they're looking to stop their skid. On the women's side, they are playing for something a little greater than a win in the standings. WMAR 2 News' Sean Stepner is at College Park tonight. Sean? Interim head men's basketball coach Danny Manning says his Terps have to ask themselves what more they each can bring to the floor as they prepare for another one of the Big Ten's toughest tests. When you're not winning games the way you want to win games or you're not playing to the level that you feel like you're playing at, yeah, there's, there's always going to be some uh, disappointment, if you will. And a lot of it is from an individual point of view, knowing that you know possibly you could give a little bit more. Losers of five of their last six games, the Maryland men host number 17 Illinois on Friday. The same Illini team that topped the Terps 76-64 a couple weeks ago in Champaign. The same Illini team that boasts seven-foot matchup nightmare Kofi Coburn. He's averaging over 21 points per game, leading the Big Ten with almost 12 rebounds per contest. You know, Kofi's a, he's a tough cover. You know, there's no doubt about it. He's one of the best, if not the best, big man in the country. We've got to make him work. Coburn had 23 and 18 against Maryland in meeting number one. Manning says forwards Julian Reese and Caduceus Wahab understand their matchup responsibilities against him better now after facing him earlier this month. While the Terps men tip off here at Xfinity Center tomorrow night, the Maryland women are on the road this evening, continuing to play with heavy hearts. Head coach Brenda Fries will miss tonight's game at Ohio State. She's in Iowa with her family mourning the passing of her father, Bill, who died Sunday following a long battle with prostate cancer. He was 89. Associate head coach Karen Blair will fill in for Fries on the bench. Our job now is, you know, to make the Fries family proud. You know, Bill stood for, he was a, a guy that packed his lunch pail every day and he went to work. Like, that's what he did. That's what he's instilled in his children. And that's why... Brenda has built this program at Maryland to be a family and, you know, around hard work. So that's what our focus is going in there is to, to honor that legacy is to, to do that. Blair says tonight the Terps are, quote, playing for something bigger than ourselves. In College Park, Sean Stepner, WMAR2 News.